not your choice between uh, not taking action and intervention. Your choice is between taking, uh, taking action now to solve the logical equivalent of a genocide in Africa or not taking action, sacrificing thousands of innocent lives for a speculative long-term impact that's based on a study from 1974. They say that overpopulation is worldwide in the status quo, but the only card on the terminal uh, carrying capacity is read by us, and it's 20 billion people. We're not anywhere close to that. We're at 6 billion in the status quo. Uh, they send our uniqueness evidence. They have no evidence which answers back two warrants in our evidence. First, our uh, evidence is predictive. The United Nations recently recanted their statements about African population growth and said that we will reach below replacement levels in sub-Saharan Africa in the status quo, which means their population will be declining. We are the only ones who have read a piece of evidence that is conclusive on this question whatsoever. Secondly, you'll notice that the 2NR never mentioned the word AIDS. That's because they don't have a single card which answers the fact that AIDS will devastate one-fourth of sub-Saharan African population in the status quo. There is zero comparative link to this disadvantage relative to the status quo decline in population. Extend our models flawed argument. These arguments are all explained above. He says it's Caldwell evidence. That guy is a joke. He says that nuclear war is good. Our chalkwell evidence answers back that response. And Caldwell's PhD is also in mathematics. He has no qualifications to talk about these things. He might be, you might be talking about these things. Our Simon evidence is more qualified saying there's no impact to scarcity because whenever there is pressure created by scarcity that opens up new technological innovations that are able to solve for those terminal impacts. New technologies are developed to distribute food. So the scarcity impacts never actually result in widespread conflict. Our call evidence indicates that this is the consensus of experts from qualified schools. They might be no University of Kentucky, but they went to some quality universities like uh, Michigan. They say that there are schools like Yale or some sort of bad models or flawed. These arguments are all answered above the consensus of Africa's disputes, their internal link claims, and the impact is just uh, not nearly as large as the X. Okay, hey, everyone from our lab.